Hi there and welcome. We're on a Moodle site called Nellie's English Projects. It's an admin practice Moodle site for anyone who's interested in learning more about being the administrator of a Moodle site. But you need to have some experience and if you have let me know and I'll be happy to uh, arrange the course for you. So let's get started with users. Notice we're under users and we're going to add or upload users in bulk. And that's how we're going to do. Now, this is really important and everything, by the way, the question mark is here to help you. And there's the information, but it also provides you with an example. Absolutely amazing, isn't it? So if you click on that, this is what you will see when you open it up. And here it is. Notice the layout because Moodle only accepts these. So notice at the top, it's all set up for you. Let me just uh, make it easier for you to view. So notice what's under A, B, up to D. All right. So first of all, username, first name, last name, email. Just like that. No caps, just as it is. And then student one, two, three, or as many students as you wish. That's up to you. Now notice here their emails. You need to put that here. And first name, you add their first name with an with a capital on the first letter and of course their last name. Now as far as student one and student two and three, you need to add a username. Now you can ask them for their username or you can just make it up. In this case, I'm going to keep everything as is and I'm going to save this and upload it to show you how it's done. So it's saved on my computer. I'm going to grab it and drag it. So there it is. I've dragged it and you don't need to pay attention to any of these. You can also have different rows depending on how many. Notice you can have a hundred thousand here. So you've got lots of, and this is important because Moodle can actually deal with these uh, users. And that's what you will get. You'll get their first name and so on and then their email. And that's it. Next, don't forget to upload users. Otherwise, you just add it. And this is it. Now I'm going to delete all of these, of course, but just to show you what it's like. Not that difficult if you know how. So now you try it and let me know if you have any questions. Thank you for watching.